In this video, we're going to do a firmware upgrade on a Samsung monitor. And in fact, you can apply this process to all Samsung devices. This is a 49 inch Samsung monitor. So I'm here in the download center. So I'm going to type in the model number. So let me go and check for the model number. My control button is underneath the monitor. So I go and I'm going to go down to support and go to information so I can get the model number for my monitor. And there we go, I have the DC model. I see that the current firmware is 1016.0. My current firmware is 1010.2. You click to download the file to the desktop. And then when it downloads, you're going to expand the file, transfer it to a USB. So it should be an IMG file. So you're going to get a USB A memory stick and format it for FAT32. Place the files on there after you expand it into the root behind the monitor. There are two USB A slots. One is for servicing. I'm going to go to the monitor and I'm going to press the power button, which is also the control button. And I'm going to navigate to the menu. Inside the menu, inside service, I'm going to go to information. Inside information, I'm verifying that the monitor firmware version is 1010.2. I'm going to go to support. And under support, I'm going to click software update. Software update is going to search for the files. If indeed I am plugged into the correct service port, that service port should light. And it said that it did not find the USB stick. So I'm going to go back now and I'm going to remove the USB. So I inserted it to the one that's closer to me. So it says the USB device should be connected to the USB service port that's labeled service. So I click OK and I click software update again. Now it found it and I'm going to click the OK button to start the update. So there are two USB ports. One is labeled service. You must insert the USB stick into the port that's labeled service. There are gonna be two ports in the monitor. It would only work in the one that says service. So once I insert it into the one that says service, the USB is inserted into the service port on the monitor. Select the menu. I'm gonna select support. Under support, I'm going to select software update. Now I click software update. It's going to search the USB service port only. It found it. It's comparing the two. So my current version is 1010 and the new version is 1016. I click OK and it begins to do the software update. Very important. Do not disconnect the USB. Do not lose power. The monitor will restart on its own when it's completed. So the monitor's firmware has been updated to 1016.0. Like and subscribe for more restaurant reviews and tech tips.